miners should not be continue, not pushing ahead with this operation in Malaysia. There's very strong opposition from the local community at Kwantan, and there's every reason that this waste, this toxic waste, should not be left in Malaysia. The refinery should not even be built. It's quite an extraordinary story that we still don't know all the details. Why has this company, Linus, been given a 12-year tax break, holiday from paying any tax by the Malaysian government? Why hasn't an environmental impact assessment been required before such a plant that will have such an enormous impact on the local environment and the local people? And this is where I'd like to go back to some of the comments of Mr Curtis, who is working overtime, and I imagine he'll be saying some comments today at the AGM, that everything's OK, there's no health problems here. And that's what he has said about this toxic, low-level radioactive dump that would be imposed on the people in Malaysia at Kwantan. But one of the local doctors has disputed his comments, and he said he's very wary of Linus's assurances. The argument, he goes on to say, that low levels of thorium in the ore make it safer doesn't make sense because radiation exposure is cumulative. So the people of Malaysia have spoken clearly. They don't want this stuff. I've heard that from them personally, and it's certainly an issue I feel very close to. In my first week in the Senate, the first group I was lobbied by was 12 people from Kwantan who came here to talk to politicians, to hold a protest outside the headquarters of Linus, and work with local groups like Friends of the Earth to develop a good network of support. And they gave such a clear message that they did not want this refinery in their backyard, where it would be close to tens of thousands of people, to people who are like livelihood depends on fishing. It is so deeply wrong. In this day and age, when we know the dangers associated with low level radioactive active toxic waste, it is not good enough. Australia should not treat our neighbours like this. On the right, Linus does build the line wasting dump at Western Australia. Just follow you know, the rule uh, at Australia, like strict rule, environmental yeah. rule at Australia. So I don't want like the Linus to build a plant at Malaysia because like Malaysia got so many issues, you know, to the like maintaining you know the waste and until now Linus couldn't like provide the long term how them like manage the waste. So I really worry about you know like Linus building the plant at Malaysia. Well, my concern is about the environmental issue, uh, about you know uh, the safe di disposal of, of 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 you know the tailings when they have finished. How are they going to um, you know have it uh, safely disposed of uh, without any uh, sort of a concern? Uh, for the people living around that area. It's obvious, isn't it? I mean, in Western or in Australia, they wouldn't have got a, a hope in hell uh, to have that plant. You know, the, the restriction will be many times stricter than what it is in Malaysia. And obviously, you know, it's a new form of, you know, sort of uh, imperialism, if you can say that, you know. Um, um, uh, exporting it to a poorer country.